My name is Emily Gray, and this is my incredible story. I had osteosarcoma, which is the bone cancer. I went through the whole episode of losing your hair and I weighed 25 kgs. I had the choice of a hip replacement or uh, amputation through the hip. I chose an amputation just because my survival chances were higher. My family were really supportive and my friends from school, I was really fortunate to have them. Um, and also having cancer, I didn't actually understand at the, at the time what it actually was. That's when my dad actually introduced swimming. At first I hated it, but then I actually grew to love it because I guess the way the water holds me and the way I can move in the water really like connected to me. Well, I've, I've learned to see a disability as mostly in your head, you know, it's, it's what you make of it, and it's what you think of it. Having a disability is obviously life changing, but it's almost for the better. If you had to say to me, would you still make the, ch the choice to amputate your leg? And I'd say, yeah, definitely. Get up at about five and have training at 5.30. Train for about two hours in the water. And then I go to gym and I gym for about two hours. I'm again back at the pool and I do dry land work, you know, like push-ups and sit-ups and stuff like that for about another hour. And then I swim for another two hours. And then by the end of the day, I crash into bed pretty early. <laughs> My ultimate goal as an athlete would be to inspire generations to come.